I'm Daniel from Stratus LEDs, and in this video, I'm going to show you the 2x2 array. The 2x2 is basically a 400 watt drone light that's made to fit inside of a Movi Pro camera stabilizer. It uses four parabolic reflectors to create a tighter beam. So it's more of a spotlight effect than our larger lights like the aerial array. So the ability to put it inside of a Movi Pro camera gimbal really allows the operator to aim the light however they wish. Um, and on this one in particular, we've got a little FPV camera here. It's actually sending a video signal down to the gimbal operator and that allows them to aim the, the light very precisely. With our other lights, like the 10 module array, it has a 60 degree beam. So the drone operator just kind of aims the light by moving the drone. But this is a much narrower beam and requires much more precision in aiming. The whole gimbal and light weighs about 14 pounds, so it's no problem for the Alta 8 here to lift. The system will fly for about 10 to 12 minutes on a set of 10 amp hour 6 cell batteries. So we'll take a closer look at how this light works here. I'll pop the Alta 8 off the top. It's basically just four 100 watt modules held together by a 3D printed frame. In the middle of the four modules, we have a LiPo battery to power them. Right now I'm using a 10 amp hour 6 cell battery. It's the same type of battery that the Alta uses for flight. The wiring here in the back is basically just the four 100 watt modules connected together in parallel. And then the red and yellow yellow wires are the on off signal wires. So those are basically just combined in parallel and then connected to this digital on off switch here. And that allows us to control the light, turning it on and off um, with a spectrum RC receiver. And this RC receiver is also connected to the Movi Pro for gimbal control. So we use a spectrum DX8 like this for gimbal control and then turning the light on and off. Here we have our FPV camera, and then the video signal is sent back to this little FPV transmitter right here. It's just a 5.8 gigahertz analog transmitter. On the battery, we have a little cell checker here to warn us when the voltage is low. This will just start beeping. That's very important so that you don't over discharge the LiPo batteries on accident. This is a great system for emulating police helicopters or just getting really unique artistic lighting effects. So now we're gonna put it up in the air and see how it looks. 